Hey, 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 what's up everyone? It's your boy Angelo Jackson And today we got a hot topic to discuss Gilbert Arenas has gone off about Caitlin Clark being snubbed from Texas USA Olympics team This is some serious stuff And we're going to break it all down Let's get into it But y'all know what's been going on with the technophiles already So let's just shoot to it USA Today Two sources indicated that there was concern over how Clark's fans would react to her not getting much playing time in the Olympics. So I got to ask you, gentlemen, hmm? did Team USA make the right decision leaving Caitlin Clark off the Olympic roster? No. Mm. I think it was the wrong, wrong decision. Why do you think it was the wrong decision then? Well, for me, I think don't they always like bring in like the like the, the money makers they always make like a Olympic team like from Christian Lake there to so, yeah. th so team USA that year in 92 they had to have one spot yeah, for a just, college player mm -hmm. I think it was between Shaq and Christian Laidner uh, Laidner obviously a senior at that point player of the year yeah. got the got the nod with, over Shaq they went with the one who was more popular yeah yeah oh, he was a little popular, he was yeah. popular yeah. I mean yeah the Duke the Duke thing but Duke also thing. just the optics of it he was the a graduating optics. senior Optics, okay. Yeah. So we, we, you get it. So the optics, the one with the bigger name. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> got it. Okay, sounds. No, no, he been real. Mr. Arenas, he been real. So have they did it on the women's side. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. That's what I'm asking. Thing. So we talking about women's basketball, and we can't compare them to the men. Well, they like. Well, no. But we can't. But we can't in this. See, look, this thing. We we could, we can. I'm gonna tell you why. Because it's a sport. It's basketball. It's not men's basketball women's basketball i'm talking about the sport basketball just like football just like hockey golf basketball ain't just for for man only you get what i'm saying it's a sport anybody can play it so i i don't agree with uh keon martin on that however we look at basketball should be for each side. You get what I'm saying? It should be balanced. It shouldn't be like, okay, women's basketball do this, men's basketball do this. No, it should be basketball rules. This situation we cannot. It's the WNBA. Have, the, have they done it before? WNBA. Have they NBA. done it before? They go by, they. Have think. they? I'm asking you a simple question, dog. I don't Once know. I've never it, watched it. Have they? I so never therefore, watched the WNBA. Olympics. Have they done? Have they I've never watched the WNBA? We so don't. Who knows? So well. So I therefore, think, I, I know they said a couple. Uh, so, so we have researchers here. So have I they done it before? Ken Parker probably made one of them as a rookie. Or yeah, I think she made. Sure? I think yeah. she was no, also one, snubbed from a squad when uh, she was snubbed from a squad from the coach Gina Arium. Right. Yeah. So how was? Dang. So have they done it before? A rookie. That's all I'm asking. Yeah, I think they've done a rookie before. A rookie. Yeah, I think so. Okay. 2000. We're, we're. I didn't want to be one of those. Well, either way it goes. So, so let me ask you, so who was she supposed to be over make the team over, Nick? Hmm. No. I, but I'm just saying, you got so, so, so I'm, finna, I'm finna read the years experience that these girls have, but right? But still, you so need to have. Seven years, eight popular. years, five years, seven years, 11 years, 10 years, 20 years, nine years, six years, 11 years, six years, nine years of experience playing in the WNBA. Is this so the, who, all they first time playing in the uh, Olympics? No. no. So, so they, somebody so who, could have been left out. So True. therefore, of the girls' experience, the one with the least. Look, 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 look. What uh, they trying to say, what Nick Young trying to say is, it shouldn't be about experience. And if it is, somebody that already played in it should just give up their spot. So basically, if this was LeBron or Kobe we talking about, Michael Jordan, they would automatically be on there. We know that. So it should be the same thing for Caitlin Clark. She's an upcoming star. She's doing good. Even uh, Lisa Ree should be in there. I mean, we're talking about upcoming stars who's selling uh, tickets, who's selling Nike deals, sponsors, all this. Like, who who do the people want to see? Okay, so the people want to see this person. It's only right that I bring them there so they, my my viewership views are up as well. That's all we saying. That's all mostly everybody's saying. Like, they're not clearly thinking whoever thought to do this a snubber is like, okay, y'all don't want nobody to watch. That's what they're saying. Y'all not really trying to make no money. Y'all not really trying to get gold. Y'all not really trying to make this a story or something that is public. 
publicized. Like people want to see the Olympics. If Caitlin Clark was there, just real talk. I don't really watch the WNBA. I really don't watch the NBA. But I'm just saying, if Caitlin Clark was in the WNBA uh, Olympics, it would be something talked about. It would be a story behind it. People will watch. Guarantee. It's Sabrina. Sabrina Are they has going five years. Anyway. Sabrina they, has yeah. five years. So, Kenya, to answer your question, uh, Rookies have been on the Olympic team before. Of course, I'm just Rebecca saying, but, Lobo but in college. You know, I'm talking about the college player. Yeah, but Rebecca but no, Lobo rookie, in rookie. college, like incoming players. Yeah, yeah. So right? the rookies. Uh, so, yeah. rookies. But so. she already is there. Yeah. She's yeah. already there. But Chris Lakeman wasn't on in the league yet. He was not. That's what I'm saying. Because there's two different situations. No, no, no. Because the, speaking of, remember the season starts. Yeah, but, but so they're, they're, you know, our, yes. uh, yeah. But they had to have a college spot on there. They had to. That's what yeah, I'm they, so they, here, they, they don't force them to have that guy. No, because here's a rookie. So if they try to do a, uh, a college player, that college probably would be a junior being a senior. senior. Okay. Yeah. That's so. to get that point. But my thing is, with the years experience, the one with the least is Sabrina. Mm-hmm. Is she better than Sabrina? No, at mm -hmm. this point, no. At this point, mm -hmm. that's no. what I'm asking. So, with the one with the least experience, uh, it's Sabrina. No. Was we ever talking <clears throat> about Sabrina and all of them before this? Yes. Did we just talking about the Olympic team. We I, talked about the last Olympic team. Anybody? Sabrina. No. More than Anybody likely made care that about who got snubbed? No. Sabrina more than likely made that one. No. Okay, this is. Ago. But, no. Okay, like. It's just facts, man. Like, look at the facts. What Nick Young saying is a fact. It's a fact. It's a fact. He's proving a point. But everybody wants to keep going around it. It's just a simple fact. Were people upset when last year Olympics team came for the women and people that were supposed to get on that that got snubbed? Did they make an uproar how the world is making it for Caitlin Clark? No. Which shows that you're messing up your money because people want to pay to see Caitlin Clark play. The problem is this. Yeah. Is she is she better Popularity. than anyone on the team? No. no. She's more popular, yeah. Right? Yeah. She's more popular. Absolutely. And the thing the thing is this. She could be though. What is your goal as women basketball player? What is the actual goal here? Like, if the goal is to win gold, to be honest. You guys lost one game yeah, yeah. since you guys have ever been in the Olympics, all right? And that Damn. was in the championship. So l l let's not throw that in there. The, the gold is yours. Yeah. Everyone knows yeah. that, right? You're going to spank everybody by 65, 40, 30. So when you're saying yeah. whoever's on that bench, right, all of those star players on that bench, there's going to be some that don't play, yeah, and right? There might be a chance somebody right? get hurt during, yeah. and there might be so, a spot like, like so, it always is. So... I'm getting it. I get it. I get it. I get it. And they're right. When it comes down to it, I didn't know they was blowing. Congratulations to the women, man. That's amazing. They need to be talking about that. I didn't know that was, like, it's crazy that we're not talking about that. But congratulations. But in the whole, This snow could have had some serious repercussions for Team USA. It could. Money. Not having a player like Caitlin Clark could hurt them. Plus, it sends a bad message about how players are chosen. True. Honestly, I'm more with Nick, Nick Young on this one. I am. It's a huge oversight. Team USA needs to rethink their strategy if they want to stay on top but they might still be on top regardless but it's just fan wise money wise WNBA wise so alright folks there you have it Nick Young, Gilbert Arenas, Keon Martin just destroyed the reason behind Caitlin Clark team snub and I have to agree with Nick Young what do you think should Caitlin have been picked let me know in the comments below. I think she should have, my opinion. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Tell your friends. Let's get them all over here in this conversation. Let's have a good one. And don't forget to subscribe for more reaction and sports talk. 
Stay informed, stay passionate. Let's keep the conversation going. Peace out, and I'll catch you in the next one.